Hello everyone, my name is Daniel and I'm just a casual sim racer and today I want to show off a couple of mods that are relatively new. The BMW M1 Pro Car was just released in January by Baza and then Dejur's Land has been created by Zwiss. I've linked both of those in the video description. So we're going to try to work our way around the outside here at the start of this race. Just three laps here. Paint schemes are also custom, and I've linked them in the video description as well. You can download them off of Race Department. Uh, this track is a... Oh, oh, I know the brakes, they're pretty quick. But um, this track has a lot of elevation changes. It's a short track, a club circuit. Actually, it was a driver's or a lorry training facility back in the day for one period of time. Um, but really a high-quality track here. I'll try to go around the outside here. But it's definitely a high quality track that Zwiss always does great work. And then of course Baza with the Pro Car. This is one of the, I would say Baza's more difficult to drive cars. It's very challenging. If you combine that with the, the drastic elevation changes on such a kind of a tight twisty track as Jerseyland. And you end up with definitely a challenging little race here, a little drive. Lock up the tires a bit, drift a little bit wide apex, late apex, and try to get a run here, pull off this move, dive it up the inside, they break a bit early there, I get it though, it's a very tricky, you've got such a big drop right there to another corner, definitely a tricky little breaking zone. So yeah, this the skins look really good, they're all based on uh, the real life liveries put it together is definitely is a pretty cool little uh, well, the nice thing about the BMW Pro Cars was his own you know spec racing series so that's kind of unique in the history of racing and especially for the popularity it had and so definitely a pretty good and fun pack you can take it anywhere you don't need to download a bunch of cars or things like that you just got this car you can take it a lot of different places and you can have some fun you know 80s racing experience which is really nice all right, so we got one more lap here at the start finish line. There's slightly different spots. That's the finish line, start lines on the other destroyed way. But coming around one more lap here, we're up to 10th. We'll see if we can get all the way. I don't know, maybe we got this position. Let's see if we can get it to 9th to pass this car here. It's a couple of hairpins essentially, varying radius hairpins. Puts it all together, and then you just have the, uh, the elevation changes that make it interesting. If this track was flat, it would be very boring. But because it has all the interesting elevation changes, it's actually very unique. So we'll come down the front slash back straightaway, the starting straightaway, and come in for the last corner here. Got up into ninth pretty easy. Um, so, anyways, about to finish, but. Definitely recommend checking out both of these mods. Um, if you don't really want a challenging driving experience, then maybe you want to pass in the BMW. But for sure, the track is really high quality and very unique. So that's one that I definitely think that you should at least download, give a shot, and enjoy. It's very well made. So, well, uh, thanks you for tuning in for this video. I hope to catch you in another one. And I hope most of all that you'll have a great rest of your week.